just like a rainbow. A rainbow of God's <laughs> creation. Yeah, that's just good rainbows beautiful. of color. Yeah, they're beautiful. And we can't believe all the centers of the tulips, how different they are yeah. on the inside. We were just looking at one that had a blue center, and some of them look like bugs. <laughs> yeah, and some of them do. look like they're yellow and they're gorgeous, but some of them look creepy inside. <laughs> yeah. But we like the ones that don't look creepy inside. <laughs> yeah, the blue one was pretty though. But that was a soft blue. Talk the about blue talk about intelligent design. This could not have happened accidentally. Yeah. This kind of garden God has designed. That's how I feel about it. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's a beautiful place. Yeah, it is. It's very peaceful. And we're really enjoying it. Every year we get visitors from all over to just wait for the tulips. Um, it becomes an annual treat for their family and this year it's an added treat because they'll be blooming for Mother's Day. Uh, we're in the show garden at Dakotis right now. Uh, the show garden is pretty much um, in f almost full bloom and our fields are just about, uh, I'd say a quarter of the way have begun. I'm Gail Cote, and I'm part of the retail staff here at Dagotis. We're on US 12, about 18 miles east from exit 68 on I-5. My favorite part about the tulips is seeing them all bloom just like everybody else. I don't think it's too difficult to grow them. They do need some fertilizer, um, maybe some bulb food of some kind when you plant them. But other than that, they're kind of a, a very good Thing to raise flower for this area especially. We do need some sunlight. This year has been unseasonably cold, uh, but even with the snow and the rain, um, they set back maybe two weeks or two and a half weeks in bloom, but as you can see, they're still going to bloom. Well, hopefully this year we'll have good business because even though they're later, the, they are here for Mother's Day. and just so happens that there'll be a lot of things for people to see with the hanging baskets and the annuals and the color bowls and the tulips and everything will be there at once. Show garden and fields are open seven days a week. Uh, anytime uh, they can view the fields and or the show garden, we are closed on Sundays for the retail shop. Enjoy and it's it. a really nice drive. It's you don't have to, like she said, Very go nice. through Seattle and and you drive by Lake Mayfield and you know it's a beautiful drive. Mm -hmm. It's really nice for the drive. So this is just gorgeous. It's just a beautiful yeah. place. Yep, really worthwhile. It's a hidden treasure. A hidden treasure. Yeah, that's right.